we want. Today we're going to make volcanoes. We're going to use some vinegar. Measuring cups, some bottles, and vinegar. Baking soda. What? Baking soda. Baking soda. Hold on, today we're going to try this little can of... Let's do a little bit different today. This one is just vinegar. These two purple bottles are baking soda. Water. And baking soda and water. This one with the soap in it is baking soda, water, and, and soap. So you're gonna see which one makes the biggest explosion. So we have to make sure everything is mixed up. So we're gonna shake up these two purple bottles. Let's do it together. Perfect. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> oh, no fortress has worked. It filled up the whole pool. Oh, my fortress worked. It's because it's at the bottom. I wonder if I dig it. And we're adding vinegar. Whoa! It's like the fortress. Mommy, look at the little hole works. Baking soda and vinegar mix together form a form a gas. A gas? Like a stinky gas? No. A gas called carbon dioxide, which makes our fizzy eruption. Huh, that's pretty cool. So I have another question. Does the shape of the water bottle help? Yes. Why? Because of the gas is forced out and up because to the small opening opening at the top. So can you talk to me a little bit about the chemical reaction that happens? Yes. Okay, tell me. The chemical reaction occurs because we mix vinegar and acid with baking soda. It is a base. Oh, so when you mix them together, does it form something? Yes. What's it form? It forms a gas. <gasps> like PU gas or stinky gas? No. What kind of gas does it form? It forms carbon dioxide. And is that what makes those bubbles that we saw? Yes. Oh. And what happens if we add soap? Do we get more bubbles? Yes. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yes. Which one created the most bubbles? Do you remember which water bottle? That one? Soapy. The soapy water with? Bubble. Was dish soap and baking soda, right? Soap and baking soda. That had the soapiest one. Yeah, that had the soapiest one. The car's moving. He's gonna get lost. He's gonna get lost. The car's going. He's gonna get lost. 